Welcome everybody to day 43 of our shelter in place. Uh, we thought we'd share a little, I, you know, that's not, we're home, so I don't have to wear this mask. Uh, Diana, Rob, and Claire is joining us today. Mm -hmm. Say hi, Claire. The third roommate. <laughs> the third roommate. <laughs> we thought we'd just invite you into our backyard. So, um, so we're out here enjoying a glass of 2015 Diana's, Diana's Chardonnay, almost a Diana's Vineyard Chardonnay, Diana's Chardonnay our JRS Jensen Reserve Chardonnay. And why we're doing that is uh, the new Dianas will be released along with the new Neclair. We're super excited that last year, Connoisseur's Guide picked not only the Dianas, but the Neclair, both as top 10 wines of the year. And, um, and before all this other uh, crisis, uh, little sick pandemic stuff came on, we were celebrating being Winery of the Year from Connoisseur's Guide. So uh, well, we're gonna welcome you back to the winery to, to celebrate that again. Uh, but we're drinking the 2015. Uh, boy, I think it's drinking beautifully. It's awesome. Kind of five years old. So uh, I, uh, I thought Diana might share a little bit of how we named the Diana Chardonnay and how she was begging to have it named after her. Yes, because those of you who know me know that that is just how I am. Um, Want to be in the spotlight all the time. Um, we had we were this program of the barrel selection of. Uh, Chardonnay, which is a combination of some of the best barrels we have in the cellar. We have been doing since 1997 and actually 95. 95, 95. for the Chardonnay. Wow, time flies. And we that were was like 10 years ago. Calling it, yeah. <laughs> I wasn't even here yet. Oh. <laughs> Signature Reserve Chardonnay and you know, fine, but there's nothing really very personal about that name. So when we opened the tasting room and uh, we're kind of looking at different things. Rob suggested that we change the name of that Chardonnay to Diana's Chardonnay. The Pinot Noir was already Neclair, which is uh, Claire and her brother Nick's names put together. And I wasn't real excited about, I not necessarily want wanting attention, um, but I agreed to do it and I think it makes a lot of sense in that it, it incorporates our family and that's what these wines are really about, um, celebrating family. Amen. So Amen. it and all it, works. And ever since we put your name on the bottle, the wines have gotten so much more flavorful. And, uh, and, and when sure we do that, our, but... our final barrel selections, who gets the final super delicate vote? I do. You do. So, <laughs> yes. so if you like Diana's Chardonnay, then... Uh, then you, thank me. If you don't <laughs> like it, <laughs> So, uh, so, so now uh, we, uh, we, as mentioned earlier, we have our third roommate. So, uh, <laughs> so uh, Claire has been um, moved back home from San Francisco for forty days now, I think. So six weeks. Six, six weeks. So, um, so, so six what's it like weeks. being back with mommy and daddy? You know, I think it was a little bit of a transition at first. I've been living in San Francisco with a roommate in a tiny, tiny, tiny apartment uh, for a year now, and we don't drink nearly as much good wine. <laughs> Maybe the same amount of wine, but good wine, not really. <laughs> um, and so, I mean, I don't think the transition was that difficult, at least for me. Um, the three of us get along fairly well most of the time. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Um, when you behave. <laughs> when the little girl is behaving. Um, no, but it's it's been great. Um, just learning actually a lot about not only wine, but business, listening to um, these two talk every single day about <laughs> what's going on um, in the business and being here during the biggest, you know, I mean, it's a huge pandemic. It's the biggest obstacle they've uh, faced. So I've been learning a lot about, um, you know, my dad keeps saying that I'm, what do you say? I'm getting an MBA on <laughs> the side MBA here. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's it's been great uh, just being here. Um, drinking all the wine and enjoying the the roommates. <laughs> a lot of questions that people are, are asking, you know, kind of an email here and there. We thought, you know, let's turn this this uh, um, vlog into a you know more of a question and answer. So so you'll be receiving an email here, uh, well, with this video, uh, <laughs> asking for you to send in your questions. What what do you want to hear? You know, I'm sure you don't you know really care about you know what is the titratable acidity you know in the Layla Rinkin out of Vineyard Chardonnay. If you do, you know, send that question. <laughs> but for, uh, for we're going to try to answer three to five questions uh, every week. And for those who whose questions uh, that we pull and answer, there's going to be a special prize, special gift for you. So, so send those questions yeah. in. So uh, most common question is, when are you going to reopen? Well, we don't know, but I have a little show and tell. Mm -hmm. We are actively planning to reopen. 
uh, but we're going to open to club members only. And one of the things that we've seen from different countries that have started to reopen is a non-contact thermometer. So um, chances are when you uh, when you, you get a reservation, it'll be reservation only to start with, but we're going to be doing this and it is going to be scanning for both brain waves and uh, obviously you have them because you're a testrosa <laughs> IQ. And, and what your temperature is. So some so fun little things that we're working on. Uh, some recent studies have shown that the virus spreads much, much, much slower outdoors. So we're going to be focusing uh, as we go into the summer on outdoor tastings and, and uh, very widely spaced uh, you know, JRS and um, wine bar tables all the way across the patio. So we're going to have very wide spacing, lots of fun, and um, we want to thank you for, for your support. It's 43 days, you know, we're still making wine. Uh, if you're watching this video, I hope you have a glass of wine in your hand. Yeah. We're enjoying the 2015 Dianas. We want to thank you for being a club member. And if you're not in the JRS uh, yet, you know, make sure you get on the list. Thank you from Rob, Diana, and Claire from Cheers. our backyard. Thanks, Cheers. everybody.